The 4th of July wouldn't be complete without the American flag. Over the centuries, it's come to symbolize freedom for our nation and across the globe. But the flag can take a beating from Mother Nature and sometimes it needs to be replaced. A local veterans group makes that process easier. Dylan Srocki spoke with group members and learned about the impact a simple flag can have. Miss Glory does a, a really good job of just bringing some uh, uh, respect and understanding to what that flag's about, and uh, uh, we love doing it. Vietnam War veteran Nick Parnello is founder of Operation Fallen Flags. The group uses this truck, nicknamed Miss Glory, to replace worn and tattered American flags across Winnebago County. A lot of young men and women died for that flag, and so uh, it touches me deeply uh, on how uh, so many sacrificed because they believed in freedom. Operation Fallen Flags helps any business or residents whose flag needs replacing. Many who request a visit from Miss Glory are younger veterans. In that way, Parnello thinks the truck promotes unity amongst those who have served our country. We went through a lot, and we feel that some of the things we went through and got to the other side in a better way, maybe we could help our younger vets, because they struggle too. A lot of the v Vietnam veterans have uh, been willing to give up their time to spend time with the younger vets, go out with a glory truck, replace flags. It's a wonderful opportunity uh, to, you know, find that band or brother kind of thing. It's just heartwarming for us to let them raise the flag after we get everything fixed. Uh, we had one lady out here, her husband had died 10 years ago, he was a Navy vet, and unfortunately the flag just never got replaced and we came out there as a group. And my God, when we let her raise that flag, she just started crying. In 2019, Parnello and Miss Glory started visiting local schools. As part of Operation Stars and Stripes, veterans help teach kids about the history and importance of the red, white, and blue. We go out to any school that would like us to come out, and Mr. Marine, um, Ed McMahon, does a beautiful presentation talking about the flag and the sacrifice uh, that men and women have made for that flag. While COVID-19 put those visits to schools on hold, Parnello says Miss Glory has stayed busy. We've got more calls for flags. Of course, we're out there quite a bit, and people see us, and we're real happy. I'll tell you, every call is a special one. Miss Glory, I'll tell you, the truck, the truck really has spirit. I mean, it's, it's like she's really alive, you know? And so, uh, and I, I really believe she loves her vets because we saved her. She was going to go to the junkyard. You know, she's 30 years old. Actually, last year we had a birthday party for her.